guys this hey guys this is red berry and this is another great use for plain white vinegar i call it my miracle cleaner y'all have all seen my bottle just a dollar tree bottle filled up with plain white vinegar I buy it by the gallons and i just finished frying some stuff on the uh, stove and also these are great at dollar tree uh, it's a screen splatter they work really well. Uh, my daughter wanted one because she has a 10 month old that is moving all around the house and uh, she wanted to try one. So we got it at Dollar Tree and it works wonderful. But anyway, back to my original uh, video idea is you can see the grease splatter. Yep, this is all I'm going to use on this grease splatter is vinegar take a paper towel because there's no reason a paper towel in this instance is better because you don't you don't need to have to wash the grease out of the dishcloth but I'm not a huge you know paper towel user but for this job it's great now trust me when I say this now my, this stove needs a good deep cleaning uh, which means, you know, taking all this off and you can see the gunk under there. Well, if you take that off, uh, when I'm, let me show y'all. That's just from wiping it with vinegar. Not even adding baking soda. Now, if you ha need a little scrubbing action, uh, add baking soda. I buy it. You know, usually I buy it at Sam's Club in our area. They do not have Sam's Club in these areas. I think they have Costco, but I'm not a member of Costco. So I just got the biggest I could find at Walmart. Um, but let me see if I can get y'all a good... Let me turn this on. Maybe that will give y'all a good shot. You can see the shine on there. See that shine? No grease at all. Straight vinegar. So if you have a greasy stove, uh, maybe you bought a secondhand stove, and you know, the first person maybe didn't take care of it as they should have, and it's kind of greased up and tacked up, whatever. Well, get to it with vinegar and add baking soda to that job, and it's going to be great. But if you fry foods and if you keep this up, it's going to be very easy to do. Spray it down with vinegar, take a paper towel, and give it a wipe. Okay, guys, I hope this helped you. And um, I'll try to do some more videos on vinegar because um, I don't buy those designer cleaners. You know, they have seductive uh, commercials. <laughs> And you get to the store and you walk down that aisle and they just kind of holler at you or whisper to you, you know. They want you to get them. But resist the urge. Get vinegar instead. Okay, guys. Talk to you soon. This is Red Berry. Bye.